All right. I want to see the Alliance map. Okay, so none of these are available. Oof. So this is the progression by the looks of it. What can I not highlight? Whatever that is. There it is. Yorvik's available. Interesting. Well, let me do that real quick. Tell me about Yorvik. Hytham says there are three more targets there. If that is true, you are in luck. Our old friends Jor and Ljuvina have made their homes in Jorvik. Both had status and influence in Norway, so they may have valuable insights into the city's politics. That will make my work easier. What say you then? I'll go now. Do you know where I might find Jor and Lufina? When entering a new city, it is best to ask around the ports. The people there know more than the average peasant. Hmm. Oof. Oof. Way up there? Oh, my, my, my. Uh, okay. We'll just fast travel here. Must row in these. Let the sail out. Strike up the shoe. Down, safe. Pull your horns. Is there a sea skull among you? During Run my out 19th the sail. winter, Stilbjorn ordered the construction of a new longhouse. Splendid here. hall you now see at Thornburg. To build this longhouse, he employed the help of 20 men. I was among them, as was Frade. The strongest and stoutest man I had ever seen. We set about felling trees and hewing wood for timber. Frade was the fastest of us. Dropping 41 trees in only two days. On the third day, a spindly man, Nar, was near upon felling his first tree. We can continue later. Notice I have two... I, I never burned those two skill points. Where did I get these from? Um... One, two. That seems to be the fastest path to it. Then you have this. I think. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, one, two, down. No. Let's do this. Oh. man called Nar was near upon felling his first tree. He had hacked it all the Master. way around like some yeah. mad animal. When the tree fell, it did so in the direction he had not wished. Straight down More upon Fradi. Nar called out, but it was too late. Fradi had only enough time to turn and face the doom bearing down upon him. With that, he raised his arms to embrace the timber hammer. The force of the trees falling drove Frade deep into the snowbank. Hold on, good scout. Just there, Eivor. Probably hostile. Okay, so this is going to be a very long trip. So I'm going to pick it up right before I get to it. That was unstoppable. 
All right. He's telling a story, but we have made it all the way up here from down here. Glorious kings who have not known treason will do so in time. Afton had to ensure that what was his would remain so. One by one, I saw him entrust a city or a village to his old and loyal followers. Until it came to me. Until East Anglia, I accepted my charge. There are those who bemoan not being able to fight and die on the field. Afton needs city of grieving. The Order of Ancients lurk in Shore and Luvin are settled near this harbor. Someone should know where to find them. Hmm. Little one, can you help me? I am looking for some friends. Do the names Hjor and Yuvina mean anything to you? Hmm. I think I know that name. A woman. She's from Biamiland. Very smart. She sounded funny. So I asked her once. Hope it wasn't rude of me. You want to speak to the dot master, Grigory? I've seen him talking with her before. My thanks. Hey, friend. Could you help me find some of my people? I'm looking for Hjor and Juvena. Hjor? I know him. Are you a friend? I am. Then you will get no help from me, or any of the other merchants for that matter. Now, if you don't mind. Hmm, bitter. Has Yor wronged him somehow? Okay. Have a look, oh. Sunan. Said to live around the docks. And what about me? What about my wares? Move along now. We were at a clean dock in Jorvik. Hmm. They look bitter. Must be the dog master. What gave it away? Everyone hates you. <laughs> so just explain to your friend there if your wares have been seized, take it up with the council. These merchants are not my friends, but I'm looking for some. Hjor and Luvina. You know Hjor and Luvina? What business do you have with them? We know each other from Norway. Bid farewell to that land, but not to old friends. You may be glad to hear they fare quite well in Jorvik. It does not surprise me. They're driven, and so am I. Now I would like to see them again. In a manor surrounded by flowers. That's where Hjor and Yufina live. How about some coin for my trouble? How about I cut out your tongue? Mm. Forget I said anything. This guy. A manor. Pure and Juvena have done well for themselves. Show me. Ah. Oof. Three pieces? Wow. Their home. 
place has been ransacked. And this body... It's not your Olufna. Scattered scrolls. The thief was looking for something. There was a struggle here. Looks like it continued outside. You know me. I'm a friend. Are you? You show up here like this. These people tried to kill me. Yeah. I heard there was trouble in Jorvik. I have only come to help, on my honor. Sorry, Eivor. I did not mean to doubt you. It has been a tense few weeks. Who were they? Why were they after you? They were after this. I do not know what it is, but these men were ready to kill me for it. A poor fellow soldier of Christ. You know him? I've seen a little like this before, in London. This city is in great danger. Where is your? At the Royal Hall. I will take you there. Mm. Pull up your hood. We may not be safe just yet. This way. I'll look myself here. They are still looking for me. Hide low. We can slip past them. I think so too. She can't have gotten far. Look around. Did I knock her down? Do not wander off like a stray foal. I think it is safe now. Gods, Eivor. Your arrival could not be better timed. Call it fate. I had hoped our paths would cross again. Though I imagined a calmer reunion. We fled one problem only to find ourselves embroiled in another. While King Richier is preoccupied with the money shortage, 
A group called the Red Hand has been imposing their will. The ones who attacked you? Yes and no. They are bandits, but someone is controlling them. Look no further than the names in that letter. Killing them is the reason I'm here. But they are coded. They could belong to anyone. The slush in the streets often drips from the goddess of the halls. When in doubt, look to those in power. You mean the council? Hjor is on the council. That works in our favor. Someone we can trust to find the answers we seek. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are nearly there. <clears throat> Following you, lady. Yeah, maybe run slow. There's your, your. Look who has come. It pleases me to see you, old friend. All are welcome here in Jorvik. It is good to find you well, Jor. Both of you. What are you doing here? You have not come all this way for the Yuletide. I've come to warn you, old warrior, about a rut in your city. Three figures, corrupt and dangerous. Mm. We should work together to bring them into the light and kill them before they come to power. However I may help, I am ready. Slow yourselves. Eivor. We cannot just go running around the city, poking and prodding and killing at will. They nearly did me, your Why not? What? These people send the Red Hand after her, ready to shed blood in your streets to keep themselves a secret. But they failed. Uh, this is the letter that was sent to our home. The Needle, the Firebrand, the Vault. They belong to a group called the Order of Ancients. These are their assumed names. Our leads. Listen to our Yor. She has dealt with their kind before. Corruption has seeped its way into Jorvik. But King Rishi's hands are full, which means my hands are full. Counsel on this matter will fall on deaf ears. I do not want his counsel. All I have told you stays between the three of us. But you should introduce me to the king. I'll need to align with him if we are to go about this freely. are winning this war. We should be scraping together every ounce of silver to procure food for our men. Understood, dear Farafit. But we also have a responsibility to our townspeople. The Yuletide must go on. Enough. The more you argue, the more my head hurts. Kyo, I was not aware we had company. The likes of which I did not approve. Uh oh King Rissie. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Well, Eivor of the Raven Clan, as you can see, I'm in the middle of something. Hyor, perhaps for lack of better judgment, deems it necessary that you interrupt. Why? You have a problem in Jorvik. Yes, I'm looking at it. A problem that nearly got my friend killed. Juvena was attacked by the Red Hand. They raided her home, destroyed her property, and chased her through the streets. Those bloody scoundrels again. She survived, but the Red Hand has been a growing problem here of late. And what is your stake in this? You some sort of wandering mercenary? Pretty no. much. This is Sigurd Jarl's Drenger. Took our old camp by the river Nene, as I hear it. I am far away. War chief to Haftan Ragnarsson, and this well-fed wastrel is Alden, High Reef of Jorvik. I have seen rebel groups like this before. They sit and wait, and the moment you lower your guard, they spring up like weeds. If left alone, they will take Jorvik out from under you. Not what you want. Not what Hafton wants. Oh, dear. What do you want? Tell me what you know about the Red Hand, and I'll rid your city of them. You can go about your affairs. They've been sticking their hands in coffers around the city, targeting nobles, merchants, and anyone else they can throttle. And they are growing, as you said. I would rather not be worrying about them come Yuletide. This is not something we can afford to ignore. If we do not have the means to deal with the Red Hand, we should let Eivor. Do what you can, but do it quietly. I do not want the public alarmed. 
Procure. Send funds to procure food and ale for Faravid's men. And make sure there's enough left over for the feast. But it's as I said. We don't have... Find it. I have spoken. Oh. He tells me to find more silver. Where? In a dragon's hoard? Come. I will take you back to Lufina. She will know where to begin. I cannot tell if that went the way you had hoped. It went well enough. Rishie will stay out of my way. No one can argue the Red Hand must be dealt with. Speak a word of this to no one. A circle of trust must stay between the three of us. Long have I waited for the chance to serve one of I will eagerly await your return, Eivor. And the glory You will forgive me for stepping away. I grow weary of those pissing contests. Oh. My love, I am sorry for what happened. I should have been there. Nonsense. You have your duties to fulfill. Besides, a few bandits is hardly something to worry over. I am only glad you were not harmed. Eivor, I will be around if you need me. Once you catch the tail, you do not let go. Old habits die with the struggle. Jor has changed. Softened. Politics. It takes the Norse out of a Norse. I'm happy for him. You've made something of yourselves here. Perhaps. What do you have there? Christian texts. The Gospels. Ecclesiastes. The Revelation of John. The Red Hand steals all they can find. We may run the city now, but the Christians must still be allowed to worship as they see fit. Seems the Red Hand disagrees. What's more, Althon is worried they will come for the Archives next. Between this and all the uproar at the harbor, I would say we have some leads. What does the Red Hand want with Christian texts? That is the question. Whatever it is, there is no length they will not go to to retrieve them. They have even burned people alive who refuse to hand over what they demand. Where is the largest collection of texts in the city? The archives. But they haven't been so bold as to attack it yet. Auzon keeps a close eye on the place. I'll try my luck there. I went by the harbor when I first arrived. The dogmaster looked wary when I asked about you. That does not surprise me. He's been using Jorvik's money shortage to increase taxes. As if he's been ordered to by the council. Jor would never wrong the people like that, even if Rishie demanded it. The Dark Master is a thief and a liar. A man in need of a throttling. I'll have another look around the harbor. Try the trade depot. It's where he's holding the merchant's wares. I'll get started at once. No, I need you here. Listen to the voices in this hall. Look for any signs. Changes in behavior, anything. I would swallow a horse heart to join you, Eivor. I know, old friend. Your loyalty is why I need you here. I'll return when I find something. Multiple <laughs> quests. We'll do that one since it's so close by. I should 
look around. Weapons and supplies, but not enough to arm and feed even the smallest army. Reeds, timber, food, wine, an expensive list of items to procure for a feast. Official scrolls stamped with a seal. Thank you, Alden. I will leave with peace at once. Of course. A4, isn't it? What brings you to our archives? I've come to ask about these Christian texts. Luvina tells me the Red Hand is stealing them. Mm, and destroying them. I fear they will attack these archives next. The Abbess here has offered to bring the texts somewhere safe. She's been working diligently on this matter. You flatter me, Lord. I only wish to help. Abbess Ingeborg, this is Eivor, our honored guest from the South. Eivor has offered to help rid Jorvik of the Red Hand. How can I help? An abbess does not strike me as a suitable choice against a gang of ruthless bandits. It is my duty to protect the role of Christianity in our lives. Texts like this Gospel of Matthew were created for more than just perusing. They are a gift. They spread the word of God, and it is that which must be preserved, whatsoever the cost. I admire your resolve. But unless the Red Hand is dismantled, they'll continue to harm those in possession of these texts. The Red Hand seems to know where to look for these texts. It may be someone is guiding them. What can you tell me? You know something else that much is clear. <laughs> the Abbess has her suspicions. As much as it pains me to say, I suspect something foul at the Rectory. I have heard whispering, collusion, and the Bishop. He has been sneaking around the rectory, often visiting the priests in the cover of night. Time I pay these men of faith a visit. The rectory is on the road to the minster. I should look for the bishop there. I have the Yuletide feast to prepare for as well. Uh, do drop by for the festivities, A4. Have a drink or two. I have the Yuletide feast to prepare for as well. Uh, do drop by for the festivities, A4. Have a drink or two. Well, since I'm here, I might as well get the book. Drop the ladder and interesting. Rage of Helheim. <laughs> 